everyone, it's Mrs. P. I am here to do my weekly meal plan. Um, I skipped last week just timing and some other videos I needed to do. I just couldn't fit it in. Um, I thought about going back and showing you what we had, but I thought, you know what, <laughs> let's just move forward and um, let last week just be last week. So I'm going to go ahead and do this um, today. This is, it's Thursday morning right now. And I need to go ahead and get this done so that I can make my grocery list. I've got to do my cash stuffing, all the things. Um, I do need to run into work. Today is an optional teacher work day. I've got a lot of swap time that I've uh, built up. So I really don't need to go into work except for I need to go into work because um, I didn't finish packing up all of my personal items off of my shelves and things like that. Um, I, we have to do that at the end of every year because the custodians pull everything out of the classroom to wax the floors. And um, yeah, so I've got to finish putting up my stuff so that they don't have to do that. That just saves them, you know, from having to take stuff off of the shelves before they can move them out of the room. So I've, I do have to run by the school and do that. It shouldn't take me more than an hour and then I'll get all my other stuff done. So, and I do want to say my nails are in terrible shape today. I usually like to keep them, um, I don't know, manicured and, and presentable, I guess is the word. But I just have it. I, I was so tired yesterday. I twisted my ankle at work. We've been moving stuff out of storage sheds and I just, was not up to doing my nails. So I'm gonna just let them be how they are because that's just real life. Okay, so let's go ahead. I'm gonna zoom you in and we will start this uh, menu from today, which is June 6th through June 12th, okay? Um, this is my husband's birthday weekend and he's like a little kid about his birthday. I mean, he you ask him what he wants, he's gonna tell you. He's, there's no <laughs> way around it. He, he loves his birthday. He gets that from his mom. Um, she was always a big fan. You, it, you would never, it would never surprise you to show up at her house and she would be dressed as a clown on her birthday or something silly like that. She had a great sense of humor. Uh, we really do miss her. Okay, so let's go ahead. Thursday, this is today. And um, last week when I was in um, the city, I went ahead and stopped by Sam's and uh, filled up, stocked up our freezer with some meats and stuff. So I do not have to buy any meats for this week, which is, that was the whole plan. I saved my leftover grocery money so that I can do that. Um, so we're gonna have orange chicken, which is probably a family favorite. My husband, he says that the way I make my orange chicken is better than restaurant. So, so orange chicken, fried rice, and just some stir fry veggies. My daughter will pick around the veggies that she likes. She will usually just eat like the carrots out of, not the carrots, oh my goodness, carrots. That is like her last resort vegetable. She will eat the broccoli out of it. Okay, so um, out of this, I've got the chicken. It's already, I've got it um, thawed and ready to go. Fried rice, we've got all the veggies. I just, I usually just put some peas in there because she won't eat carrots at all. And stir fry veggies, I do need to get that. I do have a little bit of a French loaf left over from um, a retirement lunch that we had yesterday. Um, I made some little chicken salad sandwiches, and so I am going to use that just as the bread. I'll just butter it and toast it, and that will be our, our bread for this meal. Okay, so Friday night is going to be my husband's birthday dinner with the family. So, um, I've already saved up. I've, I've been uh, planning for this, so I already have the money to eat out. So, we've got that planned, so nothing for here. Um, Saturday... Um, if you remember my cash stuffing, I stuffed a hundred, I about said a thousand, a hundred dollars into family fun because I knew at some point over the, this month we would do something as a family that would be, you know, a little bit of an expense. And so we decided to go to a 
minor league baseball game. Um, I've already messed up and I don't have my white out baseball game. And so we will just eat uh, just some baseball food at the, the park. Um, that $100 covers our tickets in because it's a minor league game. It's super cheap to get in and then the food. So that's already covered. This is kind of like an extension of the birthday for my husband. And my middle son is going to go with us. So, and him and his uh, fiance. So excited about that. All right, Sunday. I said fiance. She is not his fiance. Scratch that. Girlfriend. Now, <laughs> he's been talking about the question. So it's possible I may have both of my boys engaged sometime this year. I don't know. I hope she doesn't watch this. All right, baseball game. That's going to be Saturday, so nothing for either of those nights. Sunday, I am going to, well, my husband is going to make smash burgers. Um, it's just a cool way to make burgers. You just uh, make take your hamburger meat after you season it and you like put it into a ball. And we have one of those Blackstone griddle things, like the grill. And so you just put the ball out there and you use your spatula and smush it down and smash it. And then you put, like we, I like like grilled onions and uh, cheese and things like that on it. It's so good. So, let's see here. Corn on the cob. My husband absolutely loves corn on the cob. And then I'm going to make pasta salad for me and my daughter. Okay, so, because she has braces, she'll eat corn on the cob if I cut it off, but she would just assume eat the pasta salad. All right, so smash burgers. We've got the hamburger meat. We need hamburger buns. Oh, I'm out of frame. I'm sorry. Hamburger buns. Um, we'll need the corn. I need to get some fresh broccoli. I don't need too much broccoli. I, guys, <laughs> it never fails. I misspell something on my menu. Um, and you guys catch it every time. So, thank you. I, I, I can spell, but when I'm on camera, sometimes those tricky words get me. All right. So, I've got pasta and I've got all this stuff to go in there except for the broccoli. So, I need to get some fresh broccoli. And let me think. Um, did I use, I think I need to get some onions because I think I used all of my onions last week. All right, so that is all for that. All right, Monday, let me zoom out just a little bit. Monday, I'm going to do, I, when I was putting the meat that we bought at Sam's in the freezer, I saw I still have some frozen salmon. And my husband is not a fish person, but he has some things in the freezer that he could cook with that, like some clam strips. So. He will have clam strips. My daughter and I will have salmon. I'll just bake it in the oven probably. Or no, I'll put it in the air fryer. It's really good like that. And I'm going to do a salad and a baked sweet potato. So I'm going to, let's see, I need salad mix and sweet potatoes. Okay. Tuesday. I also have some frozen. I found when we were putting all the meat in the freezer, I found um, some frozen cheese, no, chicken quesadillas that I had purchased at Sam's probably back around Christmas time that needs to get used up. So I'm going to do chicken quesadillas. Oop, chicken. This is a word that I don't know how to spell. Quesadilla. <laughs> I think that's right. If it's not, it's okay. Mexican rice, because I always have the yellow rice to go with this, and I'm just going to call that a day. We have some, um, the white, like, uh, queso cheese that I can put over top of that. It's yummy. All right, so Wednesday, French bread pizza. We haven't had this in a while. So French bread pizzas, I'm gonna do, um, I need to get some French bread. Walmart has gone down, it had gone up. It used to be a dollar for the, the loaf of French bread or Italian bread. 
and then it went up to like, I don't know, a dollar forty or dollar fifty, and it's back down to a dollar. So I'm really happy about that. I need to get some pasta sauce and mozzarella cheese. I think that's all we need for that. I think because I know I've got pepperoni still in the freezer. I need to take those out and let them thaw. But that should be good. Other than, you know, I don't include on the menu. I have it in my, like, uh, I my grocery list is in my Walmart app. Even if I'm not shopping at Walmart, I, that's where I store my grocery list. Because I'm almost always going to have my phone. And I am notorious for forgetting my grocery list. So what I'll do is, once I've done a video like this and planned out my meal, I'll go into the Walmart app and just add all of these things to the app so that I know that I can um, mark these off as I get them. But like some of the staples that we get every week is like milk and orange juice, chocolate milk. Um, let me think, what else is in there? Like eggs. You know, things like that. I don't add those here, but we do purchase those every week. So, anyway, that is my menu for the week. I'm going to go hop in the shower, do my nails, and head on to town. So, thank you guys for watching. I will do my cash planning video, to, or not cash, but cash stuffing video tomorrow. Um, so, yeah, stay tuned. I will see you guys in the next video. I'm going to go ahead and pull the candle over. Obviously, Nick is not showing. He's still in there. I just, this was a really quick video, so he's he's not gonna, it's not melted enough to show him. But anyway, guys, I appreciate you watching, and I will see you next time. <sighs> Bye, friends.